family. Thank you so much for being here. My name is T.Y. and this is Indonet TV where we give you good news only. guys you're welcome back yeah it's been a very long time i'm very sorry i broke down guys i was very sick and um i couldn't talk without doing <clears throat> because i had sore throat that was actually affecting my two ears but thanks be to god we are back and god is so good to us i didn't lose you you didn't lose me a lot of things has happened in nigeria uh in the past one month guys and it has been so horrible uh but we believe god for a wonderful time we keep praying as christians we keep interceding even for the kingdom and we believe that god is going to restore god is going to renew and god is going to keep all of us safe can i hear an amen so yeah to today's gist guys i'm so excited you know i'm always excited when i see the body of christ uniting and uniting like all the prayers that we have been praying suddenly god started bringing it all to pass you know i spoke about something uh like unity of the body of christ in my last video if you have not seen that video though gained a very little audience but nevertheless nevertheless maybe because i've left the channel for a very long time but i know that the Eduno tv fans the die hard fan mm, is anyone like that like my fans like my friends like Mm, mm, mm. okay they will not leave no retreat no surrender no leaving no no transfer okay i know that you guys are always here so yeah like i was saying people are always here i value everyone stopping by watching and if you're watching for the very first time oh, oh and you have not subscribed ah please now subscribe okay on the notification button because you need to be back to back okay so yes i saw this news online and i was so excited about four square gospel church they are celebrating their anniversary you no know, commission some uh, properties and also aggression of some properties the highlight of the program is actually the testimony of bishop david oyedepo that was given by the overseer of four square gospel church guys i was so marveled like the man said they've been together for like 42 years and gave the testimony mentioning jccf that one i'm i can reason with but that was two years ago i wasn't born <laughs> so the jccf while i was in school i know about that i was part okay even though i was not an esco but it was a wonderful time always a wonderful time anytime we gather it's like the joint christian campus fellowship so he said bishop has been a man of faith even since then and that he has never failed i just want us to see the video I want you guys to pick one or two things the grace the faith you no know, the bond a lot of things are just embedded in that video so i want you guys to take a look and see for yourself somebody shout hallelujah hallelujah Somebody who is excited to be in the house, raise up your two hands and shout hallelujah. Amen. You can have your seats. I know today is a special day. The Lord told us last night, fear not. The Lord will do great things. And he will indeed do great things in the name of Jesus Christ. I have the singular honor and privilege to introduce to us my father. I met him 42 years ago, 1979. And since then, he has remained a true father until now. By the grace of God, some of the traits you see in me, I picked it from him. As far as this country is concerned, is the apostle of faith. I'll tell you a story. When we were still on campus and he was our leader, we were to buy a bus for evangelism. 
and we wrote letters all over the world. And no one dime came. The one night he gathered all of us together. Joint campus, Christian fellowship in the Lauren, all the higher institutions in the Lauren. And he said, We'll buy two buses from you students. And we we'll all gathered together and we had a night vigil. And at the end of that vigil, people brought meal tickets that we took to SUG building to sell. At the end of that night vigil, some people were sent to Ibadan to bring a brand new coaster to meet us at the vigil. So, whatever we see today as a manifestation of faith, it didn't start just today. It has always been there. I want to give God praise for the life of God's servant. He's the only one I know in Nigeria who has promoted two private universities. And the two of them are doing very well. Covenant University and Landmark University. He is the chancellor to both of them. He was given the liberation mandate in 1981 after an 18-hour vision. He has heaven's mandate to preach the word of faith to set humanity free. When you hear of initiatives, you see us coming up with different initiatives. My father is the grandfather of initiatives. One of the initiatives the Lord used him to embark on to evangelize Africa is what we call AGIP, Africa Gospel Invasion Program. And we thank God that currently there's a covenant project, the current project of the hack. I want to thank God for the life of God's servants. Attributes like faith, boldness, courage, hard work, passion for the world, and passion for God, for God are things that you can pick, not just from what he preaches, but from his life. His interest in this mission has been very consistent, even before I became the GEO. When Daddy Medoye went to introduce me to him, the first question he asked is, how is Mafasin University doing? He is the presiding bishop of a living faith church worldwide. He's married to mommy, pastor, Mrs. Faith Oyedebo, and they are blessed with four adult children, David Jr., Isaac, Joyce, and Love, and of course, grandchildren. Daddy will be coming up to minister after the choir must have given us their number. But at this moment, with a standing ovation, join me to welcome to the house the Apostle of Faith, Reverend Bishop Dr. David Oyedepo. Daddy, you are welcome. You are welcome, sir. All right, guys, I saw some comments online, and the question is all about Pastor Isaac Oyedepo. Like, has he left Winners Chapel? Egjo, move closer. Like, has he left? See, all this lefting or no lefting, body of Christ. I've told us here several times, I've shared with us that we just need to come together as one, as one. We are one body, as, the, as Christ called us. I just want you guys to know that as far as I know, he has not left Winners Chapel. Mm -hmm. So his current station is Winners Chapel, Maryland, and they just commissioned a gigantic hall. I mean, a place of worship. And the bishop wasn't there, but Mama and um, David Oedepo Jr. was there, and it was a fantastic program. Uh, what I picked from there is just the, uh, the bond. I think this is just talking to families. Guys, if there's anything you are doing and you're not involving your family, you're not carrying them along, I really don't know what is going to happen to you because 
in that video all i saw was just the grace of god and the power of possibility like for people like us that are aspiring to get to bigger places that are aspiring to become great greater in life um that it has happened somewhere of course it's like a confirmation other than from the bible the olden days the this the this i hope you guys understand what i'm trying to talk about still about pastor isaac Oyedipo. i saw this short clip online uh i used to watch it with winners of maryland online once in a while but this particular one i didn't know when they actually delivered this particular message and it's talking about excellence guys hmm if there's anything we're actually doing as christians and we are not adding no working towards making it better i'm not saying for a start okay yeah the bible says i'm aware that though thy beginning may be small your latter end should greatly exceed mm -hmm. but you should be better just like me look at this channel for instance even though this channel has some challenges that god has helped us overcome by the grace of god can i hear an amen can i hear an amen <laughs> okay but you can see that from time to time i try to put in my best so that you guys can just stay here watch and be blessed and then get the right information i see a lot of polluted information around and i don't want the body of christ to be scattered that is just my goal like i want to bring information to you guys be uh, aware of what is going on and uh, get the right thing okay swallow the right information okay yeah that's just that about that so if there's anything you are doing you're not adding excellence if there's anything you are doing and you're not adding excellence as a christian and you are complaining that you are not selling or that you are complaining that you are not making progress or you are complaining that nothing is working this is not this, this is not that please watch this video it doesn't work that way no 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 i will not come to you if you will not deliver the service i am paying for let us leave breaking limits first let us leave our year of supernatural turnaround first. Let us face business. Can you do what I asked you to do? If I asked you to make me a chair, and instead of sitting on four legs, it is sitting on three legs. No matter how you pray, I'm not coming back. I have loosed myself from mediocrity. If it doesn't carry excellence, hear me. I am pastoring the kind of church I want to attend. And it's the truth. God is my witness. I will not come to a church without order. I will not come to a church without excellence. No. The time has passed where we tie robbers and tie cloths. No. It is over. It has passed a long time ago. How excellent is your name in all the earth. Our God is a God of excellence. Why are his children not children of excellence? Please hear this and hear it well. What do people pay for? It may shock you. Go to Louis Vuitton and go to all of them. Hear this. They are paying for number one, quality. And number two, service. You may carry the same material. Somebody say, hey, why are you wasting your money buying Louis Vuitton? I will buy it. Oh yes, I will buy it. Oh, it's the same thing I'm making. You can buy it for one tenth of the price. No, I am buying the name. The name that came by quality. Even if those companies now make trash, they will still, hear me, there are wristwatches that are more expensive than cars. By name. How did their name come? Excellence. How excellent is your name? In all, ay, 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 ay. in all the earth, God took time to give himself a name. A name that, ay, ay, above every other name, that at the mention of the name, all knees should bow. Hear me. All knees should bow. That came by service. It came by quality. Hear me and hear me well. I will never buy trash. Whether by a believer or unbeliever. It doesn't matter. Oh, we are winners. You are my pastor. No. No. I am paying for quality. And I am paying for it. Don't come to me and say, he's a member so he should do the project. No, no. Show me where you have done it. If you have not done it anywhere in the world, outside the church, I am not interested. I, I announce it to everybody watching. I am not interested. Don't tell me what you did in the church building. You are the light of the world, not the light of the church. The church already has enough light. Show me what you And that is that about that. So just to crown it up in this video today, I just want to talk about people that are watching womb. Okay? Like, um, 
is Tolu pregnant? Is Ella pregnant? Is this pregnant? Once these people are you no know, pastor's wife, these people are pastor's wives, these people are you no know, brothers and sisters that are you no know, that are the front line. We are seeing them. Doesn't mean that we have to be too nosy, like you want to know everything about them. See, let them share what they want to share on time. And that is what happened during uh, Dara Simi's own. I shared it here sometimes ago. Uh, how they did not share it. They don't want to share it. Leave them. Just like you and I. We, we, we are all human beings and we should be able to have control over what we share. Plus, this social media this day they use. Okay, we have to just be very, very careful of what we put out there, and you have to also be careful of what you comment and what you say. Don't be too nosy. Has this happened? Has she put to bed? Has this one that? If you want to wish them well, why not? Pray for them. Okay, the one they share with you, if they are praying for you, say amen and move away. You don't have to say amen and say, but the way I'm looking at your nose, the way I'm looking at your eyes, the way I'm looking at this, please come off it. Please, guys, don't do it again. So people don't see it as something that can harm the person, the poster, okay? But actually it does, okay? All those things are like you are attacking a mental, the mental part of people. So please, I just want to plead with us that we should stop doing that, okay? People that are guilty of that, I believe that you're going to stop. Just like me looking at you now, somebody will say, oh, because your nose is not this, your cheek is not this, probably you're this. No, 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 no. Okay, there are better things to talk about, okay? And yeah, that is just it about this video. I want you guys to keep praying for you, do not TV, guys. A lot of challenges, but I know that God is going to restore. Somebody say amen. I know that God is going to move us forward, and I'm determined by the grace of God. As long as this channel remains, I'm going to be putting forth content here from time to time. And I want to say thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for sticking by me. Thank you so much for always being here. You guys did not leave me alone once. Like I said before, I'm going to say it again, and I really want to, to know that I value you and i do appreciate you i hope you guys love this setting if you love it let me have your comments in the comment section and if you want a better one how you want it let me know if something i can work on why not if not why not if not and yes that is just it from me saying bye may the lord bless and guide you family thank you so much for being here my name is ty and this is iduno tv where we give you good news only aeroplane is passing aeroplane is passing <laughs> oh my god oh my god oh my god it's 11 10 i need to rush has it gone okay let us go once again hope it's not too dark I don't want you guys not to see me or oh, hey, Joe. I want you guys to see me. So want to go. Jesus have your way. Jesus take the wheel. Jesus have your way. 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 It's been long. It's been long. Now I can talk without doing crum crum crum. So yeah, let's go. The highlight of that program that actually caught my attention is a testimony of Bishop David Oedipo has delivered. The highlight.